Hi guys, welcome to another tarot, tarot video. <laughs> um, we're going to be doing um, a deck comparison of the universal weight. So little backstory about the universal weight. Um, this was a deck, this was a tarot deck that I did not own for the longest time. Um, I think it was my first Rider weight comparison video that I've ever done that I mentioned I don't have it. So <laughs> I remember somebody leaving me a comment when they were saying that you guys, some, one of you guys said you were all shocked, surprised that I didn't own the universal weight. And, um, <laughs> and so I ended up getting myself a copy. So one of these copies for the universal weight, um, I've had it for a couple years, I would say. Um, and then I recently purchased the other ones cause there's multiple editions. So, um, I am in no way, shape or form a professional, I know how of all of this stuff. So <laughs> I will probably get some stuff wrong or information wrong or whatever. So I'm just saying I'm not, you know, I don't know everything about, I don't know everything about the tarot decks and stuff, but I'm just going to show you guys the things that I have and do the comparison and talk about that. That's pretty much the whole point of this video. So um, the universal weight. <laughs> so the universal weight um, is just another a, a, just another type of rider weight um, that has a different look to the cards. It's still rider weight, but it just has the artwork is done differently. Um, the coloring is different, and it's just a fun. Um, if you're into right away, it's just a fun deck to have if you love to collect right away decks oh my god it feels so like tongue-tied I feel like I have been feeling like that all week this week where am I just I'm just so tongue-tied with my words so I apologize you guys um I'm trying here <laughs> so before we move the camera down to the table because I do feel that you get a better look uh, a better idea of the way the cards look and the, the colors and there everything just pops better in, in that view so i will definitely be going to the table view but before we do that i'm just going to show you guys the decks i'm going to be talking about so um this was the first uh universal weight deck that i purchased it is the brown box i call it the brown box i don't know if that's a thing i just call it that because it's the older edition of the universal weight so the brown box, this one, I believe, is a 90s edition. Um, and then the more <clears throat> the more newer decks are in a blue box. So I have the brown box. I also have the blue box, universal weight. <laughs> this is the more updated version. So if you order it on Amazon or if you order it on US Games, this is what you're going to get. Um, and then I also have the pocket edition, the tin edition, and the tiny universal weight tarot, the teeny tiny one. So <laughs> I also have one that's in a keychain, which I don't think I have that. I actually, I don't think I have it here with me. Um, I actually wanted to put it on my keys but I don't know if that's a good idea so I do have the keychain one but it's generally the same thing as a teeny tiny one so let's go down to the table and I'm going to show you guys this deck up close and personal do a comparison of it beautiful deck it wasn't always my favorite I will say that the universal weight um the the colors and all of that wasn't always my favorite, but once I got my hands on the 90s edition, like the older one, I feel like there's a subtle difference between the older one and the new one. So that's kind of going to be main, the main focal point of this video is to compare those two um, because I feel like they look different. So we're going to see what's the truth, <laughs> um, but my whole opinion of the universal weight changed after I got my hands on the old older edition so the brown box so let's go down to the table and check it out okay you guys so sorry for the dirty scratched up table <laughs> I need to get myself a new desk that's for sure um 
So this is the universal wink. These are all of the different editions that I have. This is the older one. This is the more new one. And then you have the pocket, the tin, and you also have the teeny tiny deck. <laughs> so first off, let's just open up the, the older one. So the brown box um, has the queen of pentacle, which the back of the newer deck has the empress. Oh my gosh. And also I didn't even notice this, but my cats started to bite my deck. I'm like, what? <laughs> so they were chewing on it. So the older box has the queen of pentacles on the back. Um, the empress is on the back of the new box. You have the queen or the nine of pentacles there on the side. And the brown box just has the text. Um, and then the, the front of it, you have a different image altogether, and then you have the fool on the front. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I just got a little notification on my phone. Hopefully that doesn't interfere with the video. Okay. So the deck comes with a title card. You have the one that's just like the box. You also have this cute little one that has a message. It says, what we see in symbology of tarot derives in large measure from our own intuition and once revealed, reflects back upon each of us to further enrich our lives. So that's kind of cool. And then you have the little white book. Um, I guess I'm assuming this is edition eight. If this is the same way that you read the yellow box um, Rider Waits. So that's a cool little thing to look at. <laughs> like I said, I don't know all of that. But, you know, if this is edition eight, that's cool. But like I said, these are this is the older, um, the older version. Okay. So... This is the, what I love about them. So they have the stars on the backs. And the older edition, I feel like the card backs, the card stock too is different, I feel, in my opinion, but we're going to compare it. Um, but it's smooth and it's not glossy. It's like a, it's a very nice card stock, but it's not glossy. Um, and I just, I feel like the stars look different even on the backs of the older edition. It's bordered. You have the white borders and you could just see, just start automatically like looking at this deck, how different it looks compared to a Rider Waite Smith. Um, I will do another video where I compare this to, um, you know, side by side, some other Rider Waite decks. But for now, let's just focus on this deck. Um, but yeah, you could see the different yellows. You see the shading, um, the line work. I always say it looks like it's been colored in by colored pencils. Like that's just how, <laughs> that's just how the artwork, the colors look to me. And I have to admit, I didn't, I wasn't a fan of this. Um, so let me open up the newer one to show you guys. So I believe I ordered all of these off of the, I know I got this one from US Games. I think I ordered these from Amazon. So I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's how it goes. So um, this one has a little white book. It's a little bit different from the way this one looks. Um, let's see if it has, no, see, this one doesn't have the little numbers to tell you which edition. Mm. Nope, nope, nope. So that's not, I don't see it here either. So I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure. So if anyone knows, tell me. <laughs> but yeah, they don't have it on here like the other one. So the title cards, you still have this image, which is on the cover of the brown box. And then you have just something about Pamela. So... so the newer deck... Let 
need to make sure I don't get these mixed up. <laughs> oh yeah, you could see a difference in the card backs. I knew there was a difference. Okay, so let me go ahead and pick up the fools. So the old one is gonna be on my right hand side. The new one is on the left. See the difference with the backs? You could already tell the the gold is it's different shade. You could tell the card backs are darker in the older edition. Way different. So that's that makes me feel less crazy <laughs> because I knew that there was something different about it when I was looking at them. So it's to me, it looks like the gold is much brighter, lighter than it is in the new ones. This one looks a little bit more blended in with the blue. I guess, I mean, that's just the way it looks to me. Yeah, much different. Um, even the borders kind of look a little bit off. And I don't know if it's just because this is an older deck. Um, the white looks more creamy in this one than it does on this one. This one looks like very white. This one looks creamy to me. But that could just be the age of the deck. So... So just by looking at the images, the newer one is darker. You could tell, especially like when you put it further out, so you could tell the newer deck is darker. The older one is lighter. It almost looks like it has, it's been like faded a little bit. Um, I guess that's the best way I can explain it. If you look at like, for example, um, cause it looks pretty damn close, but <laughs> the reds are much more darker. The orange, like this is orange, more orange, tomato, orange, tomato, red, or whatever you want to call it. And this looks red. So that's a big, um, that's a, that's a pretty cool way to see the difference. Um, the line work looks actually a little bit thicker in the newer deck than it does in the, the older one. Um, I could really tell the difference in the mountains. I could really tell the difference in the tights. <laughs> yeah, it definitely looks, this is, the older one is much lighter. So the copyright on the sides, same thing. But it does, even the copyright, like even the font, the line work, you could tell it's much darker on the newer one than it is in the older one. So interesting. That's why I love to do these comparisons. <laughs> um, okay, so side by side, yeah, side by side, the deck is pretty much the same thickness. The cardstock feels the same. They are both, um, yeah. I don't know what why don't, I, I would not say it's not glossy, but it feels very smooth. It's they both shuffle very nicely, that's for sure. <laughs> but yeah, there's definitely a difference with the colors. So oh yeah. See the the yellows, the reds, yellows and reds are much more vibrant than the older one and more red. You see that? <laughs> The reds look more orangey in the older one. The blues, mm, not so much. I think it's more the yellows, reds, and the line work. Yeah. That's why I love to compare, see? So, just by looking at that, you can kind of see the subtle differences. Um, I think that's also why I prefer the older one over the new one, because it's more muted. Um, I just tend to like that, and I like orangey reds better than red red. <laughs> That's just a personal preference. 
the yellows are much more lighter. Yeah. But it's very subtle. Even the greens, like the greens um, are darker than, like this is more like yellow green. You see that? Even in the lion's mane. Yeah, I definitely feel more, I like the older one better. Let's see. I want to see what the moon looks like side by side. <laughs> oh, the devil, yeah. So not too much of a difference. Sky is darker towards the top. The, the lobster, he's a little bit darker purple. But not too much of a difference. What do you guys think? Which ones do you guys like better? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So for the sake of the video, oh yeah, look at the wreath. Darker green, more lighter green. This is like this, this green is like more yellow green. This is green green. <laughs> um, for the sake of the video, I'm going to just keep the minor arcana out. Um, so let me put these away because I don't want to, I mean, I'm sure I'll be able to tell the difference, but you know what I mean. <laughs> just for the sake of the video, let me put those away. So we could just focus on the majors. Okay. So. Those are the standard size. So then there's also the pocket edition, which, which comes in a cute hard box. Um really really cute I love how they have the little moon and then the sun is on the, the front and then lid comes off just like that you have the little booklet yeah they don't have the additions on there and then the title cards So, like I said, for the sake of the video, I'm only going to keep out the Major Arcana so I don't have so much going on. Oh, they have the swords right there. <laughs> I have not worked with this deck, so you could tell it is, I didn't have it in, I didn't have it in the usual order that I normally would. <laughs> so there's the pocket. And then you have the tin. Not really, I'm not usually a, a tin person. Um, I like to, you know, I think that they're cool to put the decks inside of, but not so much. I'm not a pocket size deck type of a person, <laughs> if that makes sense. Um, the tin has the same, it's just, it looks like it's going to be the same as the pocket. So you have the sun on the cover. Um, yeah, so you have the same title card, the little white book. And let's just get the majors. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, I I don't like small decks. I I like standard size, so I'm not very, really much of a fan of pocket. I don't know. I just feel like they're too tiny on my hands. Like I don't have big hands anyway, but I just I don't know. I just rather have the regular size. So yeah, the tin and the pocket edition look to be the same exact thing. And then the teeny tiny tarot, <laughs> which the cover, you have the one of the title card pictures. You have the other one that's on the original. Well, not the original, but the older edition. 
and it's so cute. <laughs> See if I could do this without making a mess, a mess, a mess. Um, oh my God, it's so freaking tiny, you guys. Oh, well, there we go. <laughs> okay, it's kind of hard doing this looking through the camera. Oh yeah, I don't even think this is in order. What was it? Oh, maybe it is, or maybe not. Nope, it's not in order. Oh my God, look at how freaking tiny. <laughs> like this is just one of those decks that it's just fun. It's just fun to have. Um, oh, the backs are cute. Okay, so there is a difference with that. Oh my gosh, see, I haven't, um, I haven't really looked at this. Oh my God, okay. <clears throat> Wow, this is freaking teeny tiny. <laughs> I will have to uh, fix this later. Okay, I don't know if anyone else is like this, but when I open a brand new deck of cards, they have to be in order. Like, if they're not in order, it bugs me. So I always put my deck in order and I always make sure I have all of the cards. So this is just driving me crazy, but I have to just put those feelings aside because, <laughs> because I can't sit here and do that. But I wanted to get the full card out just so I could show you guys. Oh my God, this is crazy. So super teeny tiny deck. Um, it probably could have been in order, but maybe I just fucked it up. Um, but as you could see, it is so small. Um, the backs, it looks like we have like a circle we have little stars so cute but so tiny like literally the size of my thumb <laughs> super tiny so cute so there's that <laughs> I'll like I'll keep one out but I can't I just can't deal this is too much so the little keychain um is the same thing it's just a teeny tiny deck and you could put it on your keys or whatever but I don't know this looks to be a lot so <laughs> so cute okay so that's all of the additions um so we have the pocket and then the tin same backs for those two really cute backs so I like that that's like the main star from the star card. They look exactly the same though. So not much difference with the pocket or the tin. So you can kind of see it's the same. Same thing with the teeny tiny one. <laughs> same coloring and all of that. Um, so I would say if you guys were looking to get the pocket edition or the tin, it's the same thing. Like literally the same size so so the new one and the pocket now you can kind of see the size difference this is why I like I prefer the standard I just feel like they look better but that's my opinion some people love the, the little ones but look at that size difference as far as the colors go, I see them being pretty similar. The yellows in the pockets look a little bit darker. Same thing with the blues. Big difference with the card back, so. And then when you add in the older one, they kept Pixie's font too in all of them, so I love that. <laughs> but same thing. But when you look at the older one, total difference in the colors. More reds, darker yellows. These are more orange. The blues look bluer, purple, almost like an indigo blue. So you see that? So you guys tell me, what do you think? <laughs> 
what do you guys prefer oh, this teeny tiny one so cute <laughs> um do you guys like the more modern look or do you like the older one i personally like the older one i think the card backs look better the stars Same cardstock though. And then if you guys are wondering, the cardstock in the pocket and the tin, same thing. Very creamy feeling. It's not glossy. It's smooth. Not thick, not thin. They're perfect. So there's that. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys a side by side of the decks and yeah i just confirmed for myself that there is significantly difference um there is a significant difference between the newer one and the older one so this is the 90s brown box universal and then this is the more updated version so there is a difference in the colors and then the card backs as well and just in case anybody was wondering <laughs> <laughs> um, you can still find these pretty cheap on um, eBay. Every once in a while, you'll see them. So I got mine on eBay. Um, it actually came in a bigger box, but I didn't keep the box because it was just too big. Um, but yeah, you can still find them on eBay. So if it has the brown box like this, I could be wrong. Someone correct me if I'm wrong. But if it has the brown box like this, um, Obviously, it's the older edition, one of the older editions, and I believe it's from the 90s. Uh, not sure what exactly which date, but yeah, it's from the 90s, and I don't know. I like them, and I do want to say that there's a glossy edition of the new stuff because I did have... When I first started my tarot journey, I did have a universal weight that I had bought from the mall. And it was like at a Barnes & Noble or Borders or whatever it was back then <laughs> from the mall. And I want to say it was glossy. And then I ended up like using it as um, a project, like a, a, a little art project. So I can't go back and look at it, unfortunately. But I want to say it was more glossy cardstock but I could be wrong. So I don't know. Let me know if you guys own a universal weight. Does yours look the same? Is it glossy? What's the cardstock like? How is the colors? Does it, do they look more like the older edition? Are they more like tomato-y reds versus like a red red? Um, let me know which one looks better to you guys. And yeah, thank you guys for tuning in and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye my loves.